We're going to look today at the buildings uh, in the town of Shelton, Washington. Shelton is in uh, the western part of the state of Washington, uh, a little bit to the uh, west of the Puget Sound. This is the Puget Sound here. The town of Olympia is the capital of Washington. <coughs> We're going to come down here and look at Shelton using uh, maps from a hundred years ago. Back in the latter part of the, the uh, 19th century and earlier part of the 20th century and up to mid 20th century, the, Sh the Sanborn Insurance Map Company or Sanborn Company produced insurance maps so that insurers could determine the characteristics of buildings in areas where they couldn't practically visit and look at the building physically. I've overlaid maps from 1923 on Google Earth. So uh, we see the town of Shelton. Uh, red buildings are brick buildings. Blue buildings are stone buildings and yellow buildings are frame buildings. And uh, these are overlaid on a modern Google Earth map. So we're going to, to come in here and look at these buildings. I want to level this out a little bit so that it stays flat. Okay. Um, the main intersection of Shelton is really right here. This is Railroad Avenue. Uh, the old railroad tracks came down here and went along here over to the lumber mill. This is the primary uh, hotel in Shelton, the Hotel Shelton. And you can see as we come in here a little bit, you can see how it was laid out in 1923. The lobby, the billiards room, the kitchen and lunch room, and the dining room. And there was an upstairs where they had the lodgings. Uh, you can also incidentally see over here a restaurant, two vacant buildings, and an automobile storage and repair building. This building, uh, this business right here, the restaurant, this is still a restaurant. So we're going to come down just for a moment and take a look at, at this intersection. Okay. Here is the Pine Tree Restaurant at that corner. And here is our hotel, the Hotel Shelton, as it looks today, of course. All right, we're gonna retreat from here, <laughs> go back up, go back, orient to the north. Um, if we move west on Railroad Street, we come to another set of buildings. Um, in 1923, this building uh, was occupied, I'm gonna, click on it a minute. Uh, that building or that set of buildings were occupied by a drugstore, an ocean store, a vulcanizing store. I think those maybe, could that be tire repair? I don't know. But behind it, there's a an oil storage area, so it could be uh, a jewelry store, a millinery store, and a photo and picture framing store. And again, if we want to see what these buildings look like today, We'll just come down here in front and we'll take a look. There's the hotel and here's that lineup of buildings that we just saw from the roof line. They look like 19, like they were in 1923, don't they? All right, we're gonna exit here, orient the map again to the top. These buildings across the street are were frame buildings. They don't exist anymore, they, they're gone. And again, that's not unusual. The, the buildings are, frame buildings tend to not have the life that brick or, or stone buildings have. We're still headed west on, on railroad, looking north. Uh, this set of, of buildings, uh, mercantile company, uh, grocery warehouse storage, that was part of the mercantile company, uh, a kitchen back here and a billiards and lunchroom here. Uh, we can also see the sporting goods and, and uh, uh, billiards. And I, and I don't know, this almost looks like confectionery, but I don't know what that was. 
sporting goods and, and billiards room. I, I don't know offhand what a GF and B uh, is, is, but but uh, we could probably look it up. Drugstore, a barber shop, a bank, confection, confectionery, and cigar store. And this building, the bank building, uh, is is uh, still has a bank sign on it. I don't know if it's an active bank building any longer. I don't live in Shelton. But we'll take a look just for the interest. Down here was the hotel. This is East. Here's the bank building. State Bank of Shelton. <laughs> and the other buildings on that street. This was the general mercantile store, if you remember. All right, we're going to exit that. I'm going to orient the map again to the north. All right. Now it's we can go further west along uh, railroad. Most of these places, as you can see, are not there. These these uh, frame buildings are are gone now. They've been replaced by these more substantial buildings with. Perhaps one exception, and that is the moving picture theater. This was the, in 1923, was a moving picture theater. Going further to the, to the west, we can see a variety of, of buildings and, and functions. And in, in a frame building, there was a steam laundry. Uh, there, here is a, a blacksmith shop. Uh, here's a stationery and wallpaper. And then, uh, these buildings that still exist, they had an office, electrical supplies, a beauty parlor, uh, a meat grocery, a creamery uh, in the building. And I'll just go back down to the street level again. You can take a look at the building as it looks today. There's the building as it looks today. Set of buildings on the street. This building is the Historical Society building. I think it was the library in 1923. Let's take a quick look and see if we can determine that. Let's see. Let's exit street view. Let's go back to the north. Yep. This is the corner of Railroad and Fifth in Shelton, the post office building. And here's the library building. And there's a meeting room in the back. This is now the Historical Society building. You can take a closer look at that, and uh, we'll just do that because the Historical Society is an important activity in Shelton. Here's the Historical Society building. I'm going to leave Street View again, and I'm going to orient the map again to the north. Now, look across the street. <laughs> This is railroad again going east and west. Look across the street. There's a roundhouse. A roundhouse almost downtown. That's amazing, really. This is the day when when uh, Shelton was a busy, busy lumber and timber uh, community. And the locomotives that, that brought the timber, uh, the logs in from the forest, use this roundhouse. So here's the roundhouse, here's the machine shop and a foundry. Uh, there's some other buildings that we might recognize as being here in the in those days, but mainly the red buildings are the ones that still survive. There's there are, are an occasional uh, frame building that still survives. Uh, and and we could look at that. Uh, this is a. Let me just click this off. Okay, I can't say that those buildings are still there. There was a hotel here, uh, a, a garage. Uh, the Baptist Church was down here off of Kata. Um But most of the frame buildings are gone. Yeah. So let's back up a little bit, and uh, that was a quick look at Shelton and what it looked like in 1923.